When I was at school, um, I was at St. Aloysius, St. Aloysius College, which is in North Sydney. I was, did my secondary schooling there. We, we would have a retreat every year. And the priest came one day to give the retreat, a two day retreat. And one of the questions he put to the boys was, he said, you should think about the priesthood. You might be, you might be going to study something else or do something. That's all right, just think about it for a moment. Give some thought to it. I intended to follow a, a career, in, I hope to follow a career in science. But anyway, I thought, oh, well, I'll, give it, I'll give it some thought anyway, because he said, suggested it. So I began to think about it a bit more than I ever had before. And uh, eventually, as I kept on thinking about it, it occurred to me that I'm only going to be in this life once. I'll never get another a second chance. I've only got one chance. And if I become a priest, it certainly help my eternal salvation. So eventually, I came to the conclusion I should at least try it out. So I, uh, I, I then applied. I came here in 1979 and um, lived in an old farmhouse which is just behind the church here. And uh, the area was completely different the way it is now. That the population was mostly Australian people then, and uh, it sort of slowly evolved into what it is today, which is, which is multi-ethnic now. But really, the um, style of work has been the same all the time, providing the grace of God for souls and providing all the church wants them to have. So I hope I've done that through these years, and I've just one year just followed the other without me even noticing it. How blessed we are to have such a beautiful and caring, wonderful person like Father Ashton, who sacrifices all his life and willing to give all his time and life in the service of the Lord. Now it's up to 42 years, I'm, I'm standing myself. It's been so long, but the work has been the same all the time, trying to provide the great grace of God for souls to help them to save their souls. That's why I came here. Father Carl Ashton, our parish priest, is uh, retiring later this year. So I, I will always pray to our dear Lord to look after him and uh, to, the, to the community to extend their love and support for him and for all the other retired priests so they can uh, be comfortable in their retirement. Please give generously to our Father's Day appeal for sick and retired priests who no longer have families to help them to assist them in their old age.